Everyone, welcome back to another episode of Kirby Superstar Ultra. Last time we went through uh, the first two stages of Spring Breeze, and now we're here at Bubbly Clouds. And what can I just say, Bubbly Cloud has got to be one of my favorite levels from the Spring Breeze section of Kirby Superstar Ultra. The sprite work is just beautiful, and the music is just gorgeous. There's going to be a moment over coming up on that's going to show you just how beautiful this game can really be. I... This is a, one of those spots in question. Oh, oh. Okay, uh, bad example. Uh, you're not immune to death. Uh, this is what I get for paying more attention to the backgrounds. Anywho, this is Cracko Jr. Cracko Sr., we're gonna meet him in a second. Cracko Jr. goes through quite a couple of attacks. Uh, he will do that little slide attack, he'll drop bombs, of which I will get hit by one. Go through this attack again. I want to see if he does it, does it again. Uh, he can do... He can drop... But there we go, okay. There we go. And I... He can drop Waddle Dees as well, so you're not completely out of luck when fighting him. I don't... That being said, at the very least, if you can aim it, being normal Kirby isn't so bad. You do a pretty good amount of damage. As, so long as you don't play like how I'm playing. I'm gonna just gonna come up here and try and get this. Go. So, I probably need that ice cream now more so than ever. These flower guys. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna act like I know every boss's and enemy's name in this game. But these flowers are pretty dangerous. They can grab you and do a pretty sizable amount of damage if you're not careful. We're going to carefully grab this metal tomato because that block will give out on us. And go through this door. Ooh, and with this part, we're just going to we're just gonna float up like normal. Not worry too much about the waddle. The waddle do's. So there's two Rockies here and a door. But let's say I want to admire the scenery for a second, and oh, well, I guess that's one thing. This scenery, it's pretty beautiful, right? So beautiful. If we were to, per se, walk into the moon, you'd find yourself in this gorgeous spot. And while I'm falling, I'm just gonna let you guys enjoy the music for a bit. It's just something about bubbly clouds that just it is immediately just soothes my mind. I feel so at peace. But we should be arriving at our destination fairly soon. At least I think so. Yes. Here we go. I'm just gonna do that and hit pause. Sleep. Just a little while longer. Please let me sleep. That's how I feel every morning when I have to wake up for work. You can't do anything until Kirby wakes up. Good night. Yep. Unfortunately, or fortunately, when you swallow that enemy called the Naughty, you'll just fall right asleep, and it's adorable. And there's nothing you can do. This guy's gonna throw walnuts at me, and it's gonna suck. There's one downside to being normal Kirby OSA say, and is that you have to have good patience to wait for enemies to do things. Otherwise, you're going to be sitting here just waiting a lot. But the trade-off, I feel, is that 
Compared to some other abilities, Kirby does a decent amount of damage. Uh-oh. I don't know why everything's just going wrong. <laughs> I promise, I I keep saying that like Kirby is a pretty easy game, all things considered, and a lot of people would agree. I don't know, maybe I just don't do enough like solo Kirby runs, but all that aside, if we swallow bonkers here, we become Hammer Kirby. Hammer. This hammer packs a wallop. Punish stakes and blocks. When it's on fire, foes beware. Hammer is easily one of the most powerful abilities that Kirby has, period. There is one other ability that I would argue that's not in this game that even comes close to the power that Hammer Kirby brings to the table. It's just obnoxious how good Ker Hammer Kirby is. You can do hammers, hammer swing, giant swings, ultra giant swing, hammer flip, and a dash plus X is a hammer throw. What are the few times the X button comes into play? Let's try it out. What's Cracko? We met Cracko Jr. earlier and wow. Okay, good recovery. Go! That's the ouch. There we go. Two hits. All I had to do was two hits with Hammer Kirby and uh Try not to die. Uh, that is not my best performance. Hopefully in time I get better. Moment has come, now it's time to fight King DDD. However, we still have to go through some abilities. That's about it, really. <laughs> Let's see Hammer Flip, Hammer Throw, Ultra Giant Swing, Dash plus B in the air. There we go. Hammer throw. We're gonna save hammer throw for the fight, I say. So here he is, King Dedede. He stole all the food. Now real quick, get out of that. He can hit inhale just like Kirby can, which is something that may not come into your attention very quickly. On the right side, you'll see... Ow. This Luigi and Mario in that corner, and if we run away from the fight, there's Peach and Mario and a couple of Toads on this side as well. Hammer Kirby is no joke.
to be continued. You can now play Dino Blade, Gourmet Race, and the Great Cave Offensive. I'm so excited to get to that last one. I think I'll make that all for now. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. And I'm sorry if I seem to be a little awkward when it comes to the microphone. I'm still getting used to this whole recording business. As usual, any input is welcome. Any advice on how to improve on the audio, the video, just anything and everything in between. I know that this, this isn't a perfect run through, but I want to try and get this done to the best of my ability. So I'm always really grateful for all of you who watched this video. So thanks for watching and I hope you have a good day or a good night. I'll see you next time.